The young prince was right. With these clothes, we fit right in. Armand? Hey, where's Ron? Come out. I don't want to. <laughs> Why not? I look common. The prince is wise for his young years. Now come out and blend in along with us. Yeah, it's right. You look cool. <sighs> no one say anything. Oh, I have an idea, Chacon. What say we trade? Try Nefertina. She might trade. I am the ship of calm in stormy seas. I am the ship of calm in stormy seas. Achoo! Yes, this should do it. This is definitely the one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, mister, I am so sorry. Oh, please, no, miss. It was my fault. Everything's always my fault, believe me. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm allergic to wool. <laughs> oh, you poor soul. Here, here, let me help you. Oh, you are most kind. Nefertina is taking twice as long to shop as we did. I am concerned. I believe it is called the female prerogative. The female what? Ah, finally. But it's about time I strode up. Pardon me, miss, but you've been so kind. Could I buy you a cup of coffee sometime, perhaps? You're asking me out? No, oh, I'm sorry. I, I hope I didn't offend you. Oh, no, 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 you, you didn't. I, I just, um, don't drink coffee. Here, maybe we could watch a sunset together sometime from here. How about Friday? I have to go. Wait! Please wait! Oh. Nice lady, uh, uh, miss! Are you all right? <laughs> Let her go! <laughs> what? <laughs> before anyone sees us here. After we drop him off at the hospital. You can't be serious. Well, we can't just leave him here. Come on. Another Shapti failure. I flood the streets with them to find the mummies and those clay klutzers let them slip right through their fingers. Don't give them all the credit. You're the richest man and the most powerful sorcerer in the world. And you're not doing any better. I bet dozens of people see the mummies every day. Look here. This magazine's got pictures of Bigfoot doing his laundry. Let me see that. The Globe Tatler will pay a hundred dollars for pictures of the paranormal or supernatural. That's it. What's it? Motivation. I'll offer ten thousand dollars to anyone who can lead us to the mummies. 
One million eyes are better than my two. The mummies can't hide from a whole city, and when we find them, we'll do away with them forever. They've taken care of him. I was worried when we dropped him off last night. Now that you know your little hero has been tended to, may we please leave this sick house? Why must we be so alone in the world? Here's someone who reached out to us. I want to wait till he wakes up and thank him personally. Our duty is to protect the prince. If we are exposed to the world, if Scarab is able to trace us, the prince could be lost. You're right. Uh, uh, uh. Farewell, young sales clerk. And thank you. Mommy, uh, I thought I saw... No way. You know, get a grip, Ingsley. I am the ship of calm. I am the ship of calm. <laughs> Mommy! <laughs> He's had a little skiing accident. But, but, but they were right here. I saw them. They talked to me. Mr. Bingley, you've had some nasty bumps on your head. You're just confused. There aren't any mummies. But I saw them. I sold one address. Please, Mr. Bingley, you need to calm down. How about a little television? Maybe you're right. I'll be right back. Remember, this is Mummies Week. Mummies? And I'm Hallie Bessie Bingabel, telling you the incredible truth. We've got $10,000 for the first person who brings me proof that mummies walk among us. Can you confirm the rumors? Prove it on the next Hallie Bessie. Wow, $10,000. Oh, Mr. Bingsley. Oh, and I brought your bill for the first day. You do have insurance, don't you? I dated a mummy. My daddy was a mummy. I was a teenage mummy. Well, I got better. I was abducted by alien mummies. How about a tasty new chewable treat? Uh, gummy mummies. Where do all these nutcases come from? You in the back there. What's your story? I saw them once. Uh, four of them. Three guys and a girl. Uh, mummies, I mean. One had a golden arm. Uh, I guess that's not really proof, though, huh? That one. Bring him in and make sure he leaves with our business card. You sure? Okay, you're the boss, Mr. Stone. You there. Come with us, please. Look, just because some poor slob really saw the mummies once doesn't mean he's ever going to see them again. Oh, sweet Hecker, how little you understand human nature. Television, instant fame. They would sacrifice everything for their moment in the sun. Whoopee! <coughs> Listen. Ten thousand dollars in a show about me. Big Spingsley, mummy hunter. Oh, I need a big camera. I need a good picture. I need a great picture. Yeah, well, let's see. You got your short range, your long range, your night vision surveillance, digital audio. That's a good one. Your snooper mics. Looks to me like you're looking for someone, buddy. <laughs> Sorry. Thought I heard foreign agents. They're the trickiest. <clears throat> What about up close? Well, if you want the best. Freddy Cam. Freddy Cam? Well, they make it look like a toy. 
but it's a high-tech machine with the latest in German optics. Oh, thanks a lot! <laughs> What a loony. Okay, Elvis, I know you're out there. If it takes me a year, I'll find them. At least I can still enjoy a sunset. Sunset? The beautiful lady mummy. The sunset. We were going to meet at the beach to watch the sunset. There are times when I truly astonish myself with my genius. We've got them now. And this time, I will personally make sure they do not get away. We've been here long enough. We need to leave. Fine with me. Being out in the open like this gives me the creeps. Ever since that talk show put a bounty on our heads, I know how a desert lion feels. Hungry? That guy back at the store. He's the first real person who's wanted to be with me since we found ourselves in this new world. I know our isolation is difficult. Oh, who am I kidding? Why would a normal person want to be with me anyway? Nefertina, don't say such a thing. Heads up. We've got company. Oh, oh please, Jakal, it's him. I know it's him. We need to leave. Just let me say goodbye to him. I'll never see him again. I can't see him again. But I'd like to thank him for caring enough to help me. We were ready to hot rod. Oh, thank you, Jakal. <laughs> you came. Uh, <clears throat> so am I. I wanted to thank you for helping me in the alley the other night. I, uh, I don't know many people. Certainly no one who's been so kind. <gasps> what was that? Uh, nothing. Is that a camera? Well, of course not. Uh, I, uh... <gasps> Did you betray me? Betray you? No, no, no I, I only... What's happening? It don't leave me! With the strength of rock! This isn't happening. With the strength of the Uh, 
Where is the boy prince? I want his soul. Soul? Shabjis, have you destroyed the mummies? Huh? What? What have you done? You will pay for helping them. Leave him alone, he means nothing to you. Ah, but he seems to mean something. Scarab. <laughs> you order me. No! Give me one good shot at Scarab. We can't risk this man's life. Rap, get us out of here. Understood. one with the mummy story. Yeah, I have proof. I'm live in 15 seconds. Come on! Today on Halley Live, proof that mummies walk among us. What? He didn't have a camera when we pulled him from the beach. Perhaps he returned and recovered it. I can't believe this is happening. So, Mr. Bingsley, you claim to have taken pictures of these mummies. Yes, I think the photos speak for themselves. They babble an evil sorcerer who yearns for the spirit of a young prince. What are we seeing now? The fight to the death. No, the animal on each photo. Oh, uh, <clears throat> that's, uh, Freddy the Teddy. But what about the mummies you claim you photographed? Well, she's right there. Can't you see her? It's plain as day. Security! Can't Security. you turn it off? off my are you all right? He was nice to me once. I spent ten minutes with him and it messed up his life. There's nothing we can do to help him, Nefertina. Sometimes our job is lonely. Sometimes? You have us. And stop it! You're getting it all over me! <laughs> you were saying... <sighs> I wish I'd never met him. I don't. Vix? Hi. I didn't know you knew my name. After what you've been through, I'm afraid the whole city does. Sorry. Oh, don't worry. I'll be okay. It was worth it to meet you. Thank you for that. No, wait! Wait! 